Darling, you send me. I know you send me. Darling, you. she said okay so the sun is pretty bright right now my hair is looking whack but we are currently at the las vegas premium alice the north winds our uber driver told us that um there's actually a north and a south and that they're completely different so we're probably gonna stop by the south ones eventually but i don't know when yet i have finally bought new white vans after isabel's roommate's dog stomped on them so no more cooked vans okay no more <laughs> Okay, so we have just left um, the Movado store. Ugh. Oh, it's right, God. <laughs> Who this? So I bought two watches. I kind of caved. I saw these two that I really liked. I got this one, and I got another one that's in a box, and I'll show you guys later. But oh. bye, yeah. Isabel and I are matching now. Check it out. Ugh. She's waiting for her drink. Um, I don't know. I think we're going to head over to the 2K event after this, and then, I don't know. We might go out. Yo, I heard, I heard Nelly's in town. <laughs> So last time I was here in December, my Uber driver followed me on Instagram and he saw that I had um, uploaded a picture that I was back in Vegas and he was like, oh, you lit, you're back? And I was like, yeah. So he was trying to tell me where to go and he said, there's this place called Dre's and he's like, yeah, you can go to Dre's. Like he said, go to Dre's with Nelly or something. He was like, go to Dre's Nelly. And I was like, what? I was like, Nelly's at Dre's? I was like, what? And we were so hyped. We were literally so excited. We were like, Nelly? We didn't know he was still making music. Turns out that Nelly is just slang for like hot shit. Like, <laughs> we did as thought that Nelly was gonna be at Dre's. <laughs> I was like, whoa, Nelly's making music, y'all. <laughs> So I don't think we're gonna go to the South outlets cause Isabel will search them and they're literally all the same stores except they have like Spencer's. So <laughs> yeah, it's pretty literally. whack. So I don't think that we're gonna go. I don't know where we should go tonight. So I haven't really been recording much, um, unfortunately. I mean, I don't know, I just really haven't had anything to record. We've been doing like stuff here and there, but it's kind of like, I didn't really want to carry my camera around. Um, Isabel's in the shower right now, so I just wanted to fill you guys in on some stuff. Wednesday night going into Thursday is when we landed, literally around like midnight. And we ended up not having a room for that night, so we had to wait until 7 a.m. when they finally had a room for us and it, we had to get early check-in. And um, within that time, like when we landed and when we got our room, like we had literally nothing to do. When we landed, we called like 20 hotels, literally like 20, 25 hotels, trying to see if any of them had any space and none of them did. Like they were all like, oh, we're fully booked. And I don't know if that was like a load of baloney or what, but it was kind of annoying. So we didn't have a place Wednesday night going into Thursday. So we just sat in the lobby. We went to IHOP at like 2 a.m. When we were at IHOP, we were eating, having a good time. We were the only ones there because it was 2 a.m. And then there was a roach on the floor and we left. And that was disgusting. And then we went back to the hotel. We gambled a little bit to try and stay awake. We weren't allowed to sleep like in the lobby. They wouldn't let us. The security would wake us up, which was kind of annoying because it's like we have a reservation technically, but we just, like our room isn't ready, which was annoying. We got to our room and then around like 7 a.m. and we literally passed out for like maybe five hours and then we woke up, did some shopping. Right now it's technically Sunday. So like, I don't know what I recorded. We ended up going to the formal, which was what Isabella came here for and I just kind of accompanied her and we turned it into like a little vacation. Um, we ended up going to the formal, pretty whack. They served like trash. I'll put up a little picture or Velocity will of the food. It was like chicken mashed potatoes these really dry buns and a salad and there was corn and I hate corn so uh, We literally went there for like probably like 40 minutes and then we left we met up with Isabel's friends um, Friday night and I am not really much of a partier So we went to like the penthouse party, which was like 
her friend's party and it was pretty whack so I wasn't having a good time because it was like people I didn't know so I ended up just dipping and I went downstairs got some wings then I ate them at the bar because I didn't want to go back upstairs to the penthouse but I will attach a video here also where you guys could see there was like this random guy that was dancing with me and there was like people around trying to snatch my wings so I didn't do much dancing because I wanted to guard my wings but I'll show you guys the videos um, there's some from snapchat as well was like throwing it back on people there was me trying to guard my wings I have to leave tomorrow night. Um, I have to fly to Atlanta for something, and then I will be back home Tuesday night. So I have to pick Isabella up in the morning, Wednesday morning, because our flight was originally supposed to land at like 6 a.m. The stores that are around here are all like luxury stores where you can't record in, and a lot of other stores, like they don't like you to record in either. And then there's also casinos, so it's kind of hard to record a lot of stuff, but. Hopefully there's enough for like one one video, whatever, but. By the way guys, um, turns out I actually recorded that I bought new vans. I bought a seven and a half in men's, so it's actually a nine in women's. So I have to return them because I'm a seven and a half in women's. And um, I don't know if I'm gonna have time to do it. Maybe I'll do it tomorrow. Oh, by the way guys, um, Isabel might be accompanying me to Anaheim. So I know she hasn't really been in this vlog. She was in a little bit, um, but she said that she might come to Anaheim. So if she does, I'm definitely gonna vlog Anaheim and she said that she'd be my videographer. So that should be lit too. Isabella and I, Isabella, are on <laughs> our way to eat dinner. But we're getting teriyaki chicken. Well, she just likes she likes soy sauce with rice. That's yes, it. Rice, <laughs> rice. Um, so we just passed this guy, <laughs> and he was really weird. So we're going back. We we really okay. We realized we were going the wrong way, so we're going back up the elevator, going to the other elevator that we originally came down, and we're going back down so you don't have to walk past this weirdo again. <laughs> Ooh, who's down at the pool? I'm zoomed in. Hello, this is Dugan. He's wearing on, pants works. without pockets. We used to. He just recently cut his hair. Oh, what? what the hell? Okay. Okay. I got it. I like it. Under his soft hands. Thank you. I said you had soft hands. Well, don't tell your boyfriend. <laughs> what? Jesus. This is on tape, baby. <laughs> Bye, Dugan. <laughs> okay, Dugan. We met Dugan just like five minutes ago. He's like meandering around. He's like, he came up to his belt. He's like, I just cut my hair. My hair was just like yours. And then first, like somehow, I started touching his hair. And he yeah, was like, why? he's like, I have coconut oil in it. <laughs> and then he gave us his head to touch it. We've been walking around trying to find <laughs> places to eat. Um, there's Benihana's, but it's like super expensive. And it's like all hibachi, obviously, because that's what Benihana's is. But um, they like won't let us in. <laughs> yeah, I don't get it. The woman was like, are you, are you the Lopez's? And we were like, no. And then she's like, okay, go. But like, they, <laughs> nobody was seating us, so we just left. The sushi place is open, but we don't want sushi. And then the other place that we went to, the other Asian place that we went to, is like closed for some reason. So we don't know what we're gonna That's eat. That's weird. And then there's Italian. We have ordered some teriyaki, two teriyaki bowls, and some pot stickers. I forgot to tell you that um, I finally hit 50,000 followers on Twitter. Cool. It happened like two days ago and I didn't want to say anything. My wife went in the bathroom, she said she was having headaches, she wasn't feeling well. Could you guys check the stalls and, and, and uh, ask for Sheila? Sure. Sheila? Sheila? Is there a Sheila here? No Sheila. This is not even a bathroom. Uh oh. Okay. One eternity later. Sheila has been located. <laughs> Everything is good. She's found. Blue Gatorade, the only good one. All right, I bought a new watch. I actually got two. I'm trying to see, the background is like, changes colors, it's like translucent. It's cute, tell me it's cute. Back to my celebrating, now that Sheila has been located. I hit 50,000 on Twitter a couple days ago. I didn't like celebrate it or anything because I wanted to make sure that I was like a decent amount past 
50,000 on like the line because there's always those people that like to like just unfollow you because you just hit it and you're like, ooh, thanks so much for 50,000. They're like, unfollow. Pieces of shit. This shit ain't catching my sparkle. Hello? Hello? Some lady came up to us and brought <gasps> us some balloons for Mother's Day. I got the one with the roses and she got the little blush pink one. We just booked our room for another night because I'm leaving tomorrow night and she's staying an extra day so we had to get an extra room. So we're going back to the outlet because I bought the wrong vans. We have to go exchange them. Today I leave, Isabella stays until tomorrow. We ended up going to the Fremont experience yesterday, but I didn't vlog it because I didn't know if we were gonna like go to like a club or anything and I didn't want to be like carrying my camera. Yeah, there's a lot of weird people there. Isabella got like pulled down by someone. Okay, so I have returned my vans. I got new ones. It is like 95 degrees out right now. It's so hot. Yesterday when we were at, why am I so zoomed in? Do we keep doing this for myself or what? So yesterday when we were at the, the pool, I got so sunburned so my shoulders are literally on fire. Like they hurt so bad. But I don't know what we're doing next. Maybe we're gonna eat and then I don't know what we're doing after that. Yes, I'm it's both. I woke up and I start eating some rice <laughs> straight out of bed. Yeah. <laughs> Flex. So my can camera ended up dying while we were at the mall at the outlets. Oh my god, it's so bright! Literally didn't do anything after that. We got some smoothies, which I, I showed a little bit. We went to that shoe store where that guy was, and then we just left. Now we are at the pool, going to the cabana bar to buy some strawberry daiquiris while we figure out what the hell we're gonna do after this. Um, my flight is at 11.30, and Isabel's still here until tomorrow, so I don't know what we're gonna do. No makeup, Mel. I am currently at the airport. I left Isabella. She's still back at the hotel. Um, she doesn't leave until tomorrow, as I've said like numerous times. I had to leave early, gotta go to Atlanta for something. So I'm currently at Chili's. I ordered some homeless wings. I'm not looking forward to this flight. I hate long flights. So I'm currently in Atlanta. Um, I'm waiting to get picked up to go to set for what I'm working on. Isabella is still in Las Vegas. I think checkout is actually soon, so I think she's gonna have to dip, but I think she's hanging out by the pool after checkout until her flight, which is supposed to be tonight. So tonight I fly home too, and then um, in the morning her flight lands around 6 a.m. Eastern, and I have to go pick her up at the airport, so. Um, my flight lands tonight around like 10.30, so I'm gonna stay at her house since it's closer to the airport and I'm also parked there. Then I'm literally gonna go home and just die. Like, I need sleep. I'm so exhausted. I slept- I actually slept pretty well on the flight, I'm not gonna lie. It's actually the first time I actually slept so well on the flight, but it was also short. It was like four hours versus like when you fly, um, to the west coast, which is like a lot longer, so wasn't as bad. I slept for most of it. When I woke up at the end, there was probably about like 20 minutes left. Better go on set and then we'll see. I need some food though. I haven't eaten all day. Okay, so I am back from Atlanta and all of that. It's actually a week since I got back from Atlanta and Vegas. Um, I didn't record anything when I was at the actual shoot because I didn't really know if I could. I kind of didn't want to be annoying walking around with my camera and stuff. So the commercial is going to be out a week before E3. It's going to be on all social medias and also in GameStop. So I will share it whenever it's up. I just woke up from a nap. I'm feeling pretty crappy. I've been kind of, even though it was only three hours behind, like I've been kind of jet lagged. So I'm kind of get, getting used to it. Um, Like I said in like my previous vlogs, I'm still getting used to the idea of vlogging and what to record, what not to record, stuff like that. I said that in the last one because it really is like something I have to get used to. Like I just don't really know like what I should record, what you guys want to see, what you guys don't want to see, stuff like that. But um, I'm working on it. I'll try to get better. I'm vlogging Anaheim and I'm also going away this weekend for something which maybe I'll vlog. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. I'm going to try to upload more often now that school is done. And hopefully I'll be doing a lot of stuff during the summer. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video.